guys, so this is the latest project I've been working on. I know I didn't get a full build video on it. Uh, the main reason is because I don't have that much shop time right now. And this is kind of like a scrap project that I did just with a couple hours. And I honestly just didn't have time to um, film it. Plus I was having computer problems getting with my last video and getting all that together. And my internet's been down for a while, so it's just been a mess. So I was going to show you this real quick. So this is just a pretty basic clamp rack. I made it all with scrap wood. I already had a, this half inch plywood for the backing. I would have liked to use three quarter inch, but half inch is what I had. Um, the These main parts right here I made were leftovers from the barn door build. So that's all that wood. And these are just scrap, scraps that I've had from a different project that I've been working on. A lot of this is based off of Jay Bates design, but his design is based off of plenty of other designs. So. It's a pretty basic clamp rack system. Um, those are these two are for my bigger clamps. Um, I don't actually have that many clamps to fill it up, but you know, it's some future clamp storage. And then these are for some of the smaller clamps. I actually didn't even really space them out too well. I just kind of eyed it, and some of it's going to work, some of it's going to not. But it's it's good enough for now. I can always add uh, like some more up there or some more on the sides if I need to. And then these are for some of my larger clamps. And then this is for like my Craig style clamps that will just go like that. So I think it should work out pretty good. Uh, I don't have a full built video on this. Um, these, all these on here. So what I did was I cut them, glued them, and then Brad nailed them to the back. And then I would put in screws. These two board backer boards right here I put on just so it's not completely flush with my wall when I put them on. And then as you can see in the front, these are Tapcon screws because I am putting it into concrete block. So I'm just going to do two and one and that should hold it up perfectly. So while I don't have a full build video of this going up, I'll go ahead and film me getting this installed into the wall. so that was a clamp rack project i finished that up a couple weeks ago it's been working out fine really don't have that many clamps so it worked out okay put my clamps up there i just really need them out of the way i had clamps everywhere the day after i finished this project a friend of mine from work was like hey you, you want some clamps i have some extra clamps lying around i got new ones these are my old ones they you know they just need a little tlc i'll leave them for you at work sometime that was a couple months ago i think and we just never got around to exchanging the, the clamps or whatever so probably the day or two after i built this i go to work and you ready I have that waiting for me. <laughs> so he left me all these old Harbor Freight style aluminum bar clamps and actually even some other clamps that are already on the clamp rack. 
I was not expecting that. So being as how I just finished that claim project over there, I'm gonna have to build something else for this. So I, I'm not gonna build a bigger clamp rack. I'm just probably gonna build an individual clamp rack just for those and probably put them right up here or up next to the other one. Um, but yeah, so very thankful that I have these extra clamps, especially since I didn't pay for them. But it is kind of funny that I've been wanting to build that clamp rack for months and the day after I build it, I get this. But whatever, it's still a work in progress. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and, sub like and subscribe. I got some uh, projects coming up for Christmas time that I'll post. And enjoy it. I'll see you guys later.